suspended lawyer Rovi Medesimi, who is also known as M. Rovi, allegedly slapped a woman on her left cheek in a Hindu temple in South Bridge Road on Friday. The 54-year-old was handed four charges at the state courts on Saturday, one for voluntarily causing hurt, another for disorderly behavior in public and two under the Protection from Harassment Act. He allegedly slapped the woman at about 12 p.m. in Sri Merriman Temple, where he is also accused of shouting vulgarities and using indecent language. He then purportedly called another woman in the temple a prostitute, with the intention of causing harassment. Earlier, at about 11 a.m., he allegedly used abusive words on a man in Pagoda Street by shouting a vulgarity in Tamil at him also intending to cause harassment. Rovi was remanded at the Institute of Mental Health on Saturday for a medical examination and will return to court on September 29th. He has two other similar charges pending. On July 12th, he allegedly slapped a man on his left cheek in the vicinity of Yao Chu Kang MRT station and shouted loudly while at the station. Rovi is currently serving the maximum suspension of five years for making baseless and grave allegations that undermine the integrity of Singapore's justice system against the Attorney General, prosecutors and the law society. The misconduct arose from comments that he made to sociopolitical website The Online Citizen, as well as comments he posted on Facebook after the Court of Appeal reversed his client's death sentence in 2020. Those who are found guilty of disorderly behavior in public can be fined up to $1,000 and jailed for up to one month. If they are repeat offenders, they can be fined up to $2.000 or jailed for up to six months or both. For voluntarily causing hurt, an offender can be jailed for up to three years, fined up to $5,000, or both. Those who are found guilty of intending to cause harassment by using abusive words can be fined up to $5.000, jailed for up to six months, or both, under the Protection from Harassment Act.